Hi, and welcome to another video of Tech Tuesdays. My name is Alex, and I'm the lead software engineer at AuraPlayer, and I'll be presenting today's video on statistics. Many clients finish developing apps with AuraPlayer and ask, how do we know how many users are using the app? Which features are the most popular? And what is the success failure ratio? For mobile or hybrid apps, clients are also interested to know whether users use Android, iOS, or desktop devices. Management often asks for this data when an app goes live in order to measure the impact of the app, how well it is adapted by users, and in order to help the app grow. Aura Player's statistics feature comes to the rescue. Seamlessly integrated into apps built with Aura Player's app visualizer, it automatically captures everything you need and there is an option to activate it for externally built apps as well. When a user runs an AuraPlayer micro web service, AuraPlayer automatically collects several metadata parameters, including the timestamp, the username he uses to log into the app, type of device, and more. These parameters are eventually summarized into a bird's eye view of the entire system in the statistics screen in AuraPlayer Service Manager. As you open the statistics view, it will start with a summary of the selected period. You will see pie charts of how many microservices succeeded, failed, how many times each app was executed, how many users used it, and on which kind of devices. You may click on some of these charts to dig in further. Below, you will find accumulative charts of the same data over consecutive occurrences of the selected period, week by week over the last four weeks, or day by day over the last four days. With this view, you may see how the success ratio, apps, or user usage have changed over time. In the App Run section, you may see statistics per app, including app service calls, failures, users, and more. We also provide a convenient way to download the logs for the selected app, which may be further filtered by a service, user, or success failure status. Further down, we display statistics per feature, or in other words, per micro web service. For each service, you will find the average calls per day, total calls, number of failures, minimum, maximum, and average response times. Lastly, the most drill-down display shows failures. You may see the timestamp of every call, IP of the user, his username, response time, and any errors. It can also be switched to display all runs instead of failures only, in case that you would like to view all usage of a specific functionality. All the information we discussed here is also conveniently available for download in CSV format in case that you would like to make your custom breakdown of the data and create custom statistics. For each time that the user fires any functionality, we log a line of the parameters we see in the statistics screen, as well as unique identifiers for each app or service run, the full JSON response it received in case that this is an error, its input, and many other parameters which are introduced in separate tutorials. All of this data may be even further analyzed with simple scripts or other BI tools that you might have. To conclude, Aura Player Statistics is a powerful tool for both BI, business intelligence level, and IT support level as well. In addition to all the benefits we mentioned at the beginning, developers may also use statistics to troubleshoot issues reported by users. By filtering the data by user, feature, or a specific time frame, developers or IT may narrow down the statistics and investigate a specific time of the day, a specific app, or a user. This allows them to dig down into a specific event or help out a specific user who reported an issue and easily locate everything they need in order to resolve it. Thank you for being with us in another episode of Tech Tuesdays. And please do not hesitate to contact us for any questions. Me and my colleagues at Torah Player will be happy to assist you with any of your business needs. Thank you and enjoy the rest of your day.